Allah the Almighty says, Oh my slave, if you want to sin against me, harm me, neglect me for 10 years, 20 years, 30 years, 40 years, 50 years, 60 years, then one time in your life, only once in your life, you decided that I want to make tawbah and you said, Ya Rabb, Allah says, Ya Abdi, what do you want? Allah, Allah, Allah says, Ya Abdi, what do you want? And he said, Ya Allah, forgive me. He says, my slave, I have forgiven all your sins. Is this not a Rabb who is worthy of worship? Does this Allah not, is, is he not worthy of being praised day and night? How much love, how much love does Allah have towards us? How much love that Allah says, do as you please. So long as you come back to me with repentance and you don't associate partners with me, I will forgive you. This is Allah, my brothers. This is Allah. And Allah wants to hear your voice. Humble yourself before Him. Do it in the dark. Do it on your own. Do it in public. In wudu, out wudu, doesn't matter. Turn to Allah. Allah wants to hear your voice. Allah already knows what you do in secret, in the dark is, and Allah already knows it anyway. But Allah wants to hear your voice. Allah wants to see you humble yourself before Him. And that's why my brother, when you raise your hands and you say, Ya Rabb, Oh Allah, Oh Allah, Allah, if you don't forgive me, who's going to forgive me? Allah, if you don't have mercy upon me, who's going to have mercy upon me? Who? Allah, I knock on your door. If you don't open the door, then who's going to open the door? Who? Brother and sister, if you had the money of the world, who can forgive your sins other than Allah? Who? No one except him. الحفرة من نار روضة من نور تمضي بنا العمار ومصيرنا القبور الحفرة من نار روضة من نور رباه يا رباه رباه يا رباه رباه يا رباه فاغفر خطيئتي